Hey everybody, this is Price mixing it up. Can I get a whoop whoop? Hey y'all. So I'm going out into the yard and I'm going to plant some Roma tomatoes, some yellow squash known as early summer crookneck, and some green squash known as Ford Hook Zucchini. So I'm going to put this in the planter box and I've got some lavender I'm going to put in a couple pots. And so I want you to come outside with me, right? But as you're watching, please comment if you like to i appreciate your comments please like share and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that way you'll know when i'm uploading new content so come on with me can i get a whoop whoop while we're on our way outside see you soon this is price mixing it up please like share and subscribe i'm pamela DIY Gardening, Real Talk Topics, Cooking and Mixing in the Kitchen, Travel and Trips, On the Water, On the Plane, On the Road, On the Train. All right, y'all, here we go. Gardening Chronicles. So, about to plant these Romas, Summer Squash, Early so Summer Crookneck. And four hook zucchini and i think what i'm gonna do is put that lavender in a pot over there but i'm gonna move pot over here so because i want the lavender to grow uh this one doesn't have any weeds this is the black ones okay we're gonna put some lavender in the two black pots and set them over here in between these uh, garden vegetables and so it's about to be a storm and I just want some natural water over here. So I'm not trying on irrigation. It's not time yet. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm moving some dirt around here. And I'm gonna do some romas in this box. Some early summer crook zucchini. And some Ford hook zucchini. And then I have lavender I'm going to put in two pots so that I can have some um, pollinators flying around this area. But I'm not going to put it in this garden box with the vegetables, which normally you would do that. So we'll see how it go. I might throw some um, lavender in the middle. So I didn't bring my tripod out. I need to buy a new one. <laughs> so i am got the camera sitting over there on something. But just bear with me. I'm going to recycle and reuse right here. And I got the irrigation in already. So I want when I turn the irrigation on in the spring, when it gets warmer, I want the plants to be around it and not on top of it. Got some weeds going. So I'm just kind of plucking those up and out. Putting everything over there to the side. And my irrigation is here here, here, and here. So this is where I want to plant around these areas. So that zucchini is going to take over and I think I'm going to put it um, over on this side on this half. And I'll put the tomatoes over here since there's two drips over here and one over there. Tomatoes, so I get plenty of uh, water with one drip. So I got this cord in the middle. Okay. And then as it gets warmer, I can hand water what needs to be hand watered. All right. So we'll put our um, zucchini on this side. So it'll take up this half of the box. And it might get out of control, so we'll see. We'll see with the zucchini. All right. So the green. I had zucchini at the other house, and it just went crazy. So I'll put the green on one half of this box, and the yellow on the other half. Get my tomatoes over there. Once I, oh, these look like pumpkin seeds. Look at that. Let me show you. 
These look exactly like pumpkin seeds. Huh. I dropped them over here. Okay. So drop those. I'm surprised that's zucchini. It is zucchini seeds, I guess. Huh. Okay. You know how many it's going to take? I always do more than enough. Put about eight in there. I just want one, two, three, four plants to come up. And then I'm going to put some in pots, too. Okay. That's green. Let's use these little plastic knives to mark my spots. Okay. That rain come in, it's going to really water it today. All right. So we got the green about right here. Okay. Over here and put the yellow. I'm not trying to go too close to the edge of the pot because when it grows really big, I don't want it busting out. That's lavender, tomatoes, yellow. Let's see what these seeds look like. Like I said, I always start my plants from plants. So I never bought zucchini seeds before. Which look like pumpkin seeds. I don't know if it's too early to plant or not because our weather is so off. So I'm just going to plant. And if it comes up, it comes up. If it doesn't, I still have some time to buy seeds. Oh, these look like pumpkin seeds too. <laughs> They're smaller. Okay. A handful of those. Okay, right in that hole. And you might be an experienced gardener saying, oh, she shouldn't do it like that. Or maybe you're like me and you're saying, do your best you can, do what you want. So that's what I'm doing right now, what I want. Okay, those went there. And then this is the yellow right here. Okay, alrighty. Close those up so they don't waste. Like I said, I can put some of these in pots too. Pocket. Let's come over here for the tomatoes. So I'm going to switch the camera around. Give me a moment. All right. So the Roma tomatoes are going this side. Up. Clean the box up a little bit. It's just been sitting here waiting to be worked. The soil looks good, healthy. There's a lot of soil here in this box. the tomatoes here because there's a spivot over here for the irrigation. See how these aromas grow. Let's see what the seeds look like. Tiny like lentil beans. You guys know I like cooking, so beans, vegetables, they all mix. Okay. And down in there. All right. Let's root, y'all, in the name of Jesus. Root, 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 in the name of Jesus. Root. Huh. Root, root, root. Root, root, root. Okay. Roma tomatoes. I have a fork. <laughs> I ran out of knives. Okay, utensils are perfect. Here's the aromas. All right, so we got aromas there, squash there, 
and squash here. Let's get a pot for the lavender. Okay, I'm getting caught in the rain. I'm done. Those are two lavender pots, but it wasn't very many seeds. So let's see what happens with this. Okay, y'all. It's price mixing it up. Whoop, whoop. Gardening Chronicles in the rain. Okay, so that's our planting for today. But guess what? That rain was bound to happen. I knew it. Because over the weekend, we had some good spring days. You know, it was like summer Friday, spring Saturday, and today is winter. So yes, California gets all seasons. That's where I am. This is Price Mixing It Up. Thank you for checking in with me on Gardening Chronicles. I appreciate your views. I appreciate your subscribing. I appreciate your share. All right, check out the shorts also, okay? Because I'm doing shorts, I'm doing longs, videos, and just kind of like putting the content on when there's a chance. But again, you appreciate it. Guess what I want you to do? Remember to what? Make it a great day. See you soon. Can I get a whoop whoop?